Uh, last question. For each of the town board members, do you see any value in Attorney General Cuomo's code of conduct for wind farm development? Is there any value in that? Is there any value in that as related to what we're doing right here in this community? I guess so. And I'll say this try to plain enough that these members that have potential, keep in mind that potential conflicts of interest, mm -hmm. that's why they were disclosed, not that they were saying they have a conflict, it was a potential conflict. If that's so wrong, and I've been so wrong that I haven't addressed those potential conflicts of interest, then where is our Attorney General? Why aren't we being investigated today? I guess that's my answer to that. So you, well I don't know how to interpret that, whether you think it has any value or not. <laughs> I mean, is that, is that saying the fact, I mean, is, is, is what the Attorney General is trying to do is just a waste of time? Because I think that's important. I think it is. <clears throat> you think it's a waste of time? Yes, I do. I mean, that's, because that's fair. you have many small towns in New York State where board members, planning board members, zoning board members have relatives. And there's numerous, numerous conflicts out there. If there, if we wouldn't have a water district in the town of Cape Metzer right now, <clears throat> We went by that because everybody here would have a conflict of interest. But it's a small town. Well, the thing You're going to have conflicts. That, that's right. But Nobody has done right. anything wrong that, you know, that's. Yeah, but that's not what it's about. You know, there aren't any people in jail because they had conflicts of interest. There's, there's no one down here at our prison who's there for a three to five or whatever to help for conflict of interest. I mean, if you've done anything wrong, that's a felony, and you're generally thrown in the who's cap. What this is all about, conflict of interest, is all about the perception. It's not about any kind of crime. If you commit any kind of crime, they're going to they're going to haul you off to something else. But the point, I mean, this is important enough that the attorney general is raising issues about it. He's got a whole code of ethics on, on this whole thing, which was brought about by the way with investigations into what some of these developers were doing with the municipal authorities. And those investigations are still underway. I'm just saying, if this board doesn't think there's anything to that, I mean, it's uh, maybe there fair. is something to it if we did something wrong. But we haven't done anything wrong to it. But I see. I've been on this board so again you don't, yeah, for what? two and a half years. Mm -hmm. I haven't voted on a thing. Oh, not, a not a thing. That's right. Not a thing. But Did I do anything wrong? But that's going to change. Was I not supposed to be on the board? No, but when no, will it have... change? That's going to change when you have to vote on some issues that are related to Winfrey. It might, if I vote on it. That, that's not the question. I mean, the, the question is, like the is question there any... Made? No, it doesn't. No, the question was, do you think any, do you think there's any value with the Attorney General saying? At least Marty said no. He said so I agree with him. Okay. Yeah. So the board's unanimous on this? You're smiling. Mm -hmm. wow. I, I wouldn't have gotten that. <laughs> There's got to be value to what the attorney general. Yeah, you got to pay attention to that because kind of stuff. he's the higher authority. He's the highest York. legal authority in the state of New York. So I'm not he's not an idiot. There's no value to it. Well, there's probably value to it. You're right, but that don't mean it's for this town or other. You know, yeah. some, 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 yeah, somebody else. <laughs> okay. well, it could be. 